Good morning everyone, happy weekend. I hope everyone doing okay. You can see in here big package that I posted a few days ago on my Facebook uh, group, I think, maybe Instagram, no, I think just a Facebook. Uh, I received like in one day three packages, the next day one, and I didn't have a chance to kind of open them. Also, we will see today one of them. This package travel whole year. Well, if we think about it, it traveled from 2020. <laughs> Finally, it's arrived in 21. Uh, yes, packages travel a long time right now, but it's here and it's from FG Normal. Thank you very much, FG Normal, that this package arrived safely and all the product. So much stuff is going on in here. Let me open little by little. I have a handy scissors in here if I need it. I have my morning coffee here. Cheers everyone from Canada. Let me just pull out and see what we have in here because we will have few unboxings in here. Uh, we have in here one, two, three, cross stitch. We have in here DIY project diamond painting. One more 3D DIY diamond painting. We have in here one, two, three. I don't think it's diamond painting. Oh no, maybe this is not diamond painting. Um, and then bag is empty and we have a two pin. I was so excited about these two pieces, to be honest, uh, because you see those pants everywhere around Instagram and they are beautiful. Now you can order them at FG Normal and it's actually not bad price. So let's see what we will have today. Um, I think... Let's do diamond painting today. I will put cross stitch aside, I think, because my last video we did what? Diamond painting or cross stitch? No, we did from the other company. I'm just trying to think. We did unboxing diamond painting. There will be cross stitching and diamond painting. So I think we will do the same thing in here. Let's just see how many videos I want to make here. Definitely cross stitching will be separately. One of my friends, uh, she was hoping I would open cross stitch together with diamond painting in my last video. But as I said before, I will not mix them. I will open cross stitch with cross stitch. That way it's easy for me to store them into the playlist. I hope you understand. So let's see. Um, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. What should we do? Huh. You know what? Let's do a little at a time. Maybe, maybe we will open all of this because there's a little pieces in here but something very excited and I will start I will start with this drilling pen because they are just so cute and I absolutely love it okay for this video I mean for this episode of the pen I will bring you close to me because we want to see good first of all look the packaging it's a nice presentable packaging with this zip bag that you can just open. I like it. Like it's just a beautiful thing for the gift. If you looking for somebody for a gift, this is an amazing gift. Here is that pen. And then we have in here not just the pen, we have in here three other tools. So you have a four like five. Oh my god, it's so much in here. Okay. First of all, let's look this tool. It's oh my god, let me oh, wow. Okay. 
when I looked through the bag later, I did not see all the, um, like, how it's playing light on the inside. But look at the, like, a highlighting the pigments. It's like we yesterday opened with you pigments, mica powder. That's what, like, on the inside, the mica powder shift in color. Isn't that beautiful? We have a one pan in here, I mean one drill. And then on this side, let me see if they have a number in here or not. No, they don't have a number. So at this point, I don't know how many diamonds, maybe six or seven, looks like it. And then we have another, now I'm thinking maybe this one six, looks this one like much much smaller if I show you like this it's no idea this one clear plastic this one a little bit like see like a um, um, camouflage not not see-through then we have a trip laser and then we have a straightener so I have to say this is amazing gift with lots of tools so we have a three four five placers and beautiful pan I just can't get over it let me show you as close as possible for that I need to zoom out a little bit and now you can see no I have to keep close my background close hold on let me grab something to close back and is this way better? No, this way I create shadow. Not good. Not good. Okay, I guess this way is the best. Look at this, how beautiful the design is kind of on the inside with black swirl, then white, and then green holographic. Not holographic, but uh, mica powder, like have shifting, almost like a cat eye, the design. So I absolutely love it. And when I'm holding in my hand the way how I would drill, it's amazing how comfortable it is to hold because of the shape in here. It just fit perfect into your hand. And this shape in here kind of follow right on the top of your bone in here. And it's just very comfortable very very comfortable oh I wonder if this is gonna be my favorite pen now wow love it let's see the other one okay let's let's open this one and they have a lots of lots of colors they have a pink and dark kind of like a purplish yellow uh, blue this one light blue they have a dark blue green a uh, green in here uh lots of colors so same thing we have lots of tips in here trip placer six placer i think this one straightener this one could be maybe a six or nine well when we will drill to get together we will uh test them out and see how many oh, this one is so Pretty. This one is transparent and you can see the layer like of the ribbon like it's like It's like a ribbon on the inside of the glass look the way it's the way it's created I Have to show you better just a minute like a sideway maybe you can see how it's like a folded ribbon and it's transparent I, I don't even know which one is more beautiful. Look at that. So pretty. I'm over the moon. And I actually order uh, different colors as well. We should see them soon if, when I receive my other packages. Okay, th this is awesome. I really, really love these pens and they are very comfortable to hold. And first of all, they are beautiful looking. Will be very presentable to do diamond painting whips and chats with these pens. You can even place them as your 
know when you're doing a video and you're facing your audience this could be like on the background as um, decorative piece in some kind of cute jars if you have many different pencils and actually I was thinking about it not pencil stylist uh, or drill pen no matter how you want to call it I love it so this one I have to say it's a really good quality and actually you know what let me test it out something right now before I forget I want to see how easy it is to replace okay hopefully we're not gonna break nothing I want to see if it's easy okay you just kind of like a twist a little bit and that's how it's look like and I would place replacer probably because that would be my first thing to test it out okay as you can see I didn't put all the way to the end let me try the other one Okay, this one snap easy. Maybe I just didn't push hard enough. Plus it's new, so it's tight. It's good actually because it's tight. Okay, I'm not gonna push it because it's snap. You have to push it really, really hard. This one. Uh, looks like this one went very easy. And this one go a little bit harder. Or I just need to snap. Or that's, that's all. Maybe it doesn't go. Too far away the triplacer but it stay very sturdy it doesn't move so I guess that's okay maybe I will push later a little bit I'm afraid to break it to be honest but no it's good it stays really sturdy it doesn't move all right okay that's what I wanted to see if it's replaceable easy or not so because it's brand new it's a little bit tough but it's good you don't want this to be loose because I saw somebody before order from um, or Amazon or somewhere and this pants was just like uh, very loose I think it was a uh, Anna from Instagram she was wrapping something around to make it tight so I like that this one tight already and it's not gonna come out now the other very interesting in here it's the mask that they have up there and you know it's perfect thing for some kind of like a party ballroom party which we don't have these days I wish we would uh, like you know in those 1800s people have balls but also it will be awesome like for the Halloween okay so this is not paper this is like a leather oh that okay that's interesting I thought this would be like a paper but it's not it's very like a almost like a le leather very flexible and soft but it's sturdy enough not to break and it's a face mask which you can use for Halloween for your kids or Christmas party New Year's New Year's party for yourself uh, you can use for little girls for pageants maybe as a butterfly costume uh, possibility lots of possibility and I totally can rock this mask one day sometime I don't know where maybe just for the picture even for the sake of the picture but I mean <laughs> it's cute and it's butterfly you know I love butterflies and then there's this one and it's kind of like a new product the website so I wanted to test it out and then you have a two long actually very long ribbons to attach which go all the way in here little cuts in here on each side right there you can put ribbon in it yeah we we'll go there so let me uh, ribbon is good I have tons of ribbons I have a huge collection of ribbons in my house because I used to were addictive to it and create lots of projects with ribbons I want to see the drill area 
Volcana. Okay, I have to say that this is like the full, uh, full thing with the glue. But on a very, very edge in here, the glue a little bit is missing. If I can flush it for you, you can see that two numbers not covered with the glue in here. So for that, you can use my tip. Uh, if you have sometimes that numbers not cover, maybe you're not even close enough this last edge. I don't know. Uh, glue, tuck it over and over is the best your friend for any crafty uh, mis you know, if something glue doesn't place on it, you can always use that glue tuck it over and over. Okay, this side looks like okay, but very, very sticky uh, glue in here and it's like a basically a full drill because look how close diamonds will go in here. So all area will be placed with diamonds and a glue just like a glass, very good layer of glue. So I like that. Oh, this is so exciting and I would love to drill this together with you. Now we have in here same toolkit as always. One pen, wax and tray. And then we have sparkle gems of course and I would love to see quality of these gems because sometimes gems could be not transparent and a little bit muted colors. And sometimes we receive and like just amazing and sparkle. And I think this is one of them that will be very sparkle so far what I see. Okay, let's start from this big ones. How many colors do we have in here? Okay, definitely high quality, high quality gems. We have three in here, but look how good they are. They are very sparkle. Now the red one. Red one is really nice as well. This one like a teardrop. Okay. And then holographic on the top. It's gonna be very colorful. Now this one I believe black, yes, this is black resin diamonds, it's not your regular plastic black diamonds that we don't like, usually black resin are the best diamonds because it is not plastic, this is resin black, let me find a focus to get close to you much light but this is super super good quality diamonds of this kind and then we have in here a few more colors so we have in here uh, if I look on this one 8 and then A so I have one, two, oh, kind of counting backwards to me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and an A. Yeah, so everything in here. And let me show you, let me see first. Oh yeah, definitely, these diamonds are awesome, like the best. Oh, I love it. I love it. Let me show you close. Let just a moment. Oh, there you go. It's focusing now. You can see they are very sparkle. This one is gorgeous. Oh, look at those colors. Isn't that amazing? This rich royal blue. And then beautiful 
green and gold yellow. No diamonds with this mask are gorgeous. They are very sparkle. So I think it's another awesome project to order for kids as a gift. Uh, if you have little kids and you make a um, birthday party, parties, birthday, birthdays party. <laughs> Try to pronounce word right. This is awesome project to have, you know, when you kids come over for birthdays and you give each kids like a gift after that. Not every country do that, but for example, in Ukraine we don't have the that we give it to guest kind of presents back. So it was really surprised to me first time in Canada to realize to that. Uh, but also you can have, uh, you know, this project little together to keep kids busy and occupied and have some fun. I think that's beautiful to have something for the kids party. It's, it's awesome. Okay, I really like it and I'm excited about it because I always wanted mask. I have lots of masks that are ceramic and once upon a time I was using for a Halloween. Um, actually I painted my face as I have ceramic mask so I always love mask and I wish I have this mask back then but we will create something together now we have another 3d project and that is organizers you know I love this organizers and I have few of them already finished a two or three no I think I have a two finished and third one waiting for finishing this one but what's different about this one and what's special about this one because this one is full drill that's what amazing and I wanted to see the quality of this one it's like you paint in a canvas and actually it's a good idea for you to use small canvases that you have uh, like you know 25 by 25 maybe 30 by 30 uh, so it's come to 25 by 25 and you can purchase at the store empty container and just stitch around your canvas to it so this is awesome so this is my first organizer that has full drill and I wanted to see what kind of diamonds will come with it okay I'm just pulling from the inside same pack of tools and here it is it's it's big it's big then you put this down and it's deep so I collect in this one and they made really really nice for example if I show you like the stitching in here well, the stitching is nice on the inside stitching uh, and I like to organize my cross stitching in them and I do have two of them full with cross stitching I, I love the way cross stitching fit perfectly actually let me show you right now I had to raise my camera a little bit because this is a big tall box and if I would show you not to spoil the what the cross stitching on the inside look they fit perfect look at this so that's why I love this organizers and they fit lots of cross stitching in here so here's the three you can put like probably more than 10 in here oh definitely more than 10 uh, so yeah that that's what I like about this and you can also stack your diamond painting in here while you uh, not working on them yet you know you can just store like this and it's beautiful any other tools you can put in here or or your uh, diamonds you know possibility lots with this one no matter what kind of craft you do and you can always put something beautiful in it and it just um, beautiful stays on the um, top of your shelf and it's actually I, I really really like it so we already going on the next uh, set of um, let me put my camera a little bit down now 
Uh, so maybe we will open one more thing after this to make a video shorter and other diamond paintings we will open later because we still have to look this one now this one I think plastic stitched right into the container itself you see that it's stitched there. so I'm not gonna peel it right now till it will work so far what I see what I see I see lots of glitter seeping through in here and yeah they stitch usually it's not stitch this paper so I have to really kind of be careful and get my maybe exacto knife or no actually tweezers just poke a hole a little bit on the corner and peel that out uh, but the uh, area of the drilling it looks like a little bit canvas kind of crinkle up there unless it's a clear paper look like a, uh, I don't know can't tell right now no I think it lots of looks like ridges because of this paper top paper get lots of uh, creases that's what I say but the canvas itself up there if we look without reflective light drill area pretty good even dark symbols up there very bright and I like that this is a full drill and it's a cabin you know the cottage thing that I always like somewhere on the river mountains let me see anything I can recognize in here more I don't know feels like it should be like a deer up there or something I don't know maybe some boat it's hard to see right now till actually it's good to see a picture on the website first but I don't think there's nothing special up there only like a cabin and a woody area which I always dream to have one day and with this one we have a regular diamond paintings uh, regular diamonds are they regular they look like a not your regular look like maybe resin huh okay um yeah looks a little bit different maybe uh, because the other one my i have two diamond paintings these containers they have the tree remember like a seasonal tree different colors i have one in green one in pinks and purples i think or multicolor one so this one definitely something different a little bit because it's a full drill and also this one doesn't have a sparkle diamonds so just so you know you know if you think all organizers the same it's actually a good point for you to recognize that if you look in for the full drill of organizers they will not come in the sparkle gems but okay okay i see that's my question that i wanted to know uh each pack for this one has their symbol already on the diamonds and let me show you because this is important but we can't really count how many packages in here so we just will trust that it's all in here and i will start from one it's in here and I will show you this one. I know I asked you before if you want to see diamonds close or not. But this is kind of like important. Um, and diamonds looks like resin. Not the regular diamonds that we always have. So this is number two. Number three. Four. five definitely more sparkle diamonds i think it's a resin not plastic i, I could be mistaken but come on give me the focus that i need what six seven eight And 
and then we have you see the symbol right on the top of your bag A C E they didn't do full alphabet because we are missing a B this is G H well that's interesting that's different they um, they have a symbols on it but you know what else in here they have a DMC code Do you see that 975 976 so yeah that's good they do have a DMC code but also your symbol and a pack which is never have like this before and it's like a brown my camera keep going off the focus S and then more in here symbol T U V W X and Y so yeah definitely diamonds looks like it's a resin diamonds I don't know I, I think so they have a beautiful lots of lots of cuts very sparkle so this should look more sparkle than regular your diamond painting well okay that's very unusual I have to say it's very unusual to have this kind of um, packing and I just will put back probably on the inside okay I will have to put this inside of this bag so anyway this is awesome 3d organizers I do love them and I always recommend them to you because they are awesome awesome storages not very flimsy like you would think it's 30 bucks now we will open one more in here and this is something also new let me just sip a little bit of coffee okay so in here uh, they brought to the store a frame actually and I wanted to see what kind of quality they are because uh, for example lucky for us in Canada we can find frames anywhere in a store like a dollar store different stores uh, in different country it's not possible you have to go only into the special framing company store to frame your diamond painting or cross stitching so in here we have wood pieces uh, doesn't have in here what size in here but I will link it up for you and to assemble I need to figure out how to assemble Are they all the same pieces yes they are and we're supposed to have frame square like this okay to frame but how you put your diamond painting in it probably like the glue on the end so we just have to kind of like a slide in here uh, wood pieces I would say it could be better for example like in here it's a little bit rough looking I would recommend company to get a little bit more and see like the piece is kind of a little bit is coming out in here piece so definitely you need to send them before and I will send because you don't want to get a splinter in your finger uh, so I would recommend if company would like in a factory they did send them to make it more smooth but is it easy to assemble oh yeah see like it, it, it's go right in it
there. Oh wow, that's nice. Look at that. Fit like a glove. Very nice. Okay. So here you go. We will try to assemble the other one. There. It's actually very, very easy. It's easier than I thought it would be. And now I'm just going to put a little bit. Hold on. Hold on. Maybe this side a little bit. And then I kind of need at the same time. Or maybe this one will go. Mm, I have to do this one side. The last piece is more a little bit tricky. I have to pull it out a little bit. So I can put this on the top in here. Okay. In here. And now we have to do both sides together so it doesn't break. didn't push this one further <laughs> it's not very comfortable on camera hold on let me just push it off the camera because I have to get in okay okay I still need to push a little bit more in here because I have a space in here but here it is it's actually uh, very easy to assemble I thought you would need to kind of like a staple or something so actually I really like the way they created it's easy assemble but the thing is it's only like it's flat so if you want to put your diamond painting or something uh, for example right let's just do example on this one let's pretend you have a um, canvas that you put on a top and you wrap around and this is going to be like your frame um, with this I would recommend because is there anything I miss? No, it's empty. Uh, I would recommend them to add to the framing little hooks and screw maybe so you can actually um, put your screw in here or maybe like two on each side so you can hang on a wall but in here you don't have nothing. So that's the only my recommendation will be and I know FG Normal always watching my videos and looking for suggestions to make their website better and yeah this is definitely or even like some kind of um, ribbon even so you can or a little chain to hang so it's nice on a, on a wall but definitely you would need to put like a little uh, canvas and then edges wrap around this frame like you would do an artistic um, um, canvases when you buy another store for the painters um, yeah because I thought maybe this is some kind of a frame that involved like a glass need to be put it in so this is really simple really simple frame to wrap your canvas around and staple it and that's it but definitely need to be in a kit a little bit some kind of hooks or um, or um, yeah screw with the ribbon but also let me let me show you what else you can do just a second i have been collecting because i have idea some idea this piece is from the popcorn and this is great resource for you to use them for your framing and i did this years and years ago when I was in a card making uh, design and we would do some kind of like a 3D project and I would use this one you just kind of like I need to bend one piece out so it's sticking out a little bit or make a um, put like or glue or little staple on each side so this hole would be like 
a little bit see like you can do like sticking out so it's go flat right into your wall or hide behind but bend this out a little bit so it's hiding behind your frame so this is great idea if you are a pop drinker beer can drinker uh, you can definitely save this for so many users in the crafty world great idea for your frames all right so I think we are already more than half an hour in the video and I don't know should we open one diamond painting canvas just one and the other one too maybe open later uh, to create three videos from this one what are you saying okay let's open this little one in here and then rest of I will post video next week or maybe on the end of this new week since this is like a you know weekend already canvas very close I better break and wanna cut canvas let's see because I don't remember what's inside as it was a long time ago okay that's actually good that I decided to open this one now it is winter image and because of the package travel a little bit long time so it came a little bit later than it should be and let me restick to make it a little bit more beautiful cardinals the birds that I love you know oh this canvas actually glue what is stinky time from time I have this no, it looks like it's looks like sticky. Good. Because sometimes I find that canvas that it's stinky that it has like a different kind of type of glue that one that like moving diamonds very easy. But this one looks canvas sticky good enough. Uh, and look at that. The, the image itself are beautiful. Just a little bit too late for Christmas because I believe it's a Christmas tree up there behind with the lights. And what is this lantern? The canvas picture itself beautiful. Yes, a little bit late show up for Christmas, but that's okay. Uh, you know, on a winter we drill flowers, so why can't we drill winter images on a summer, right? Plus it's still winter, so it's still good to have a winter images go. And we have in here 20 colors and it's already almost flat canvas is perfect like no creases whatsoever and if I show you in here on a darker area how it looks like looks good I think looks good this canvas doesn't have glitter what do you know <laughs> lately every canvas almost every canvas have glitter on it this one doesn't have a glitter so for those who don't like glitter you will like more of this canvas me I love anything sparkle so also we have a DMC code with this one which is awesome and it's a 40 by 30 size in my last video unboxing I asked you if you want to see diamonds um, as usual or just like in the pack and here I'm, I'm looking at it has a few extra bags inside which is always nice uh, and some of you say that you still want to see diamonds all the time each pack some of you say yes I can skip this part and just show maybe like um, time from time some some certain color maybe something unique color or something just to see the quality of the diamonds if they all good or not so it's kind of like 50 50 um, so I don't know I will do 50 50 probably sometimes I will show you all the diamonds uh, all the way sometimes maybe I will show you diamonds like for example in here we can't really see much like this right but if I open like this and count them you kind of can see them but it's reflecting um, maybe I still can 
lower my camera a little bit more to me uh, and while I'm counting count them you can see kind of color still you cannot see it but let me count first and then we will talk about three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen 18, 19, 20. This diamonds looks to me like diamonds from that. It feels like they are better. It's like a new diamonds factory now producing or what? Because it looks the same, but it feels like they are better quality than was like months ago, let's say. I don't know, maybe my imagination. Let me show you this coat. Like, I will show you a few colors very, very close. And we can see so close that we can see kind of cuts on them. I hope you do see. Look how clean. They look very shiny, which kind of hard to see right now. How about those bright colors? Let's check these bright colors, bright red. This one even more brighter. See how shiny they are. Feels like it's not plastic but resin almost like I don't know. Like this this is unique color. I I love this color. It's not too often, but I guess this is new popular color then more and more often I start to see this and that's what kind of DMC is it uh, number five five hundred sixty three uh, definitely not familiar DMC code to me so it's kind of like new I didn't see too often and next to it <clears throat> a little bit darker number four 562 yeah so 62 and 63 they two of them kind of like unique my camera shut on me again I guess it's time to say goodbye or what uh, something's going on I think I overwork my camera <laughs> need to give a break uh, okay I think it's awesome I, I love it everything today was awesome I love this especially this 3d projects and these pens are amazing so I definitely would recommend if you wish to have for your own collection or as a gift they are beautiful they are beautiful really really love this one and we will drill with them in my next video probably so yes let me know what do you think what do you think about these frames you think you it's something that you would order I did not put this side good enough. I have to push a little bit more. Uh, definitely like the idea they have a full drill now. The only thing it's not sparkle anymore. So depends what you like. If you like sparkles, maybe you like better partial of this one kind. Uh, I wish they would kind of maybe combine. This, this kind combines sparkles with the regular drills in the mix. Would be beautiful as well. Frames, it's good if you don't have possibility to buy frames in your area. That would be good for, to wrap. And they do have a different sizes. This one is just a... I pick smaller one just to see what it look like. They have a, like a longer one a little bit or bigger square. So check them out. I will link it up everything under my video. And next time in my video we will do cross stitching unboxing. And they are very interesting. They are beautiful. And of course I'm a very very addictive to cross stitching. I cross stitched last night again to 2 o'clock in the morning. I can't help it. Okay. Thank you so much for staying with me today. Thank you so much after normal for this beautiful pack. And I will see you all tomorrow as I record every single day. And thank you so much to all new subscribers. For the last 28 days I have 
uh, over 350 50 subscribers I think so welcome welcome all to my channel uh, have fun look through my playlist and see what you can find helpful there's lots of tutorials lots of different playlists and I hope we will stay connected I love you all I wish you stay healthy safe and happy crafting days to all of you